Um, Sue, I know this collection is inspired by My Fair Lady. Yes. How did the whole process come about? Well, My Fair Lady is one of my favorite movies of, of all times, and it really stars a young uh, and beautiful Audrey Hepburn at her utmost, um, uh, at her utmost elegant and uh, fashionable. Mm -hmm. And uh, I loved all the costumes and the hats that were designed by the uh, incomparable Cecil B. Uh, Beaton. And, uh, you know, I, I love the theme, uh, which is really one of uh, remarkable transformation. And it's ultimately a, a story about, uh, well, it's, it's a story about self-empowerment and also the power of transformation, mm -hmm. which is really synchronous with my theme of uh, beauty, magic, transformation. Mm -hmm. um, that's really my, my own personal mantra, as well as a mantra for my company. And the story of uh, My Fair Lady is really about how one Professor Higgins made a bet with his colleague that he could take a common gutter snipe, mm -hmm. uh, a st street flower, uh, flower vendor girl, mm -hmm. and um, make her into this really beautiful, elegant, mysterious duchess. So um, I think that you know my clothes really have that power because mm -hmm. what I really create we try to create this beauty, and the agents of um, beauty um, have these alchemical um, aspects, which uh, are magical, mm -hmm. and uh, they in turn become transformative. Absolutely. So, so I like to think that you know when a woman puts on a Su Wong, mm -hmm. she becomes a bewitching goddess or enchantress, and witnesses all the beautiful ladies wearing Su Wong. Absolutely. I mean, the women, these clothes are so beautiful. Thank you. Can, absolutely. Can you describe the woman who wears your clothing? Um, the woman who wears my clothing is an appreciator of beauty, mm -hmm. and she um, really is a more uh, self-empowered woman, mm -hmm. and uh, she really relates to uh, the visuals around her world, and she's a very visual and probably a more creative, uh, flamboyant, expressive personality because my clothes are very, very expressive. Uh, they're, you know, just really sort of, I'm, I'm the uh, ultimate maximalist or self-proclaimed maximalist, and I love details. And the reason why I chose to have this event at my house is that this house is also full of details and it serves as a perfect backdrop for my clothing. I've noticed that throughout, you know, a lot of your collections, Hollywood is a big inspiration for you. Well, you, you, you see why. Because, you know, being a child of, you know, communist revolution and basically uh, growing up, you know, with struggling immigrants, I really kind of went into my fantasies of watching those iconic movie stars. I thought they were the most glamorous goddesses in the whole universe. So they are still my iconic muses and my inspiration for today. And what would you say to the ladies out there that might not be able to go out and purchase one of their your beautiful gowns? How can they feel glamorous at home? Well, I think, you know, beauty, again, and glamour, uh, and magic, <laughs> starts from the inside. So you really have to really feel great about yourself, and you have to start feeling beautiful from the inside, and then it will manifest into your outward um, modality.